so I'm in a dilemma. <laughs> So, I'm coming at you live at 8 p.m. on a Monday and I have so much left to do. And the reason being is several things. One, I still haven't worked out today because I didn't wake up early because I'm exhausted and I wanted to sleep a decent amount of time. So, I woke up at a normal time this morning and got ready and then went straight to work. Problem is, I didn't finish all my work today at work. That's the first problem, but typically on Mondays, I spend a little extra time either at home or in the office working on this one report that takes me just a lot of time. So now that being said, have I finished said report? No. So that's my problem is one, I took, I took home work with me that I didn't finish in the office. Two, I still have a lot of personal things to do, such as complete this YouTube video that I have not even really started, which is the one that I'm filming right now, and it's Monday morning, and my videos usually go up Tuesdays, and there's no way I'm not meeting my own deadlines because I'm too committed to myself to miss my own deadlines. So, that's that. And then I'm filming a like video that takes me a little bit more time, and I have to do that pretty much every day and i still have to film for that so the video that i have planned for tomorrow i won't be able to get in tomorrow because i don't have the time to edit that video because it's a little bit more complex to edit so as a result i'm filming this video and i'm taking you guys along a i guess not, i would say night in my life but it's just a very atypical night because this usually doesn't happen I usually don't have this many things to do. Luckily, I already ate some dinner. I came home, I got my nails done, and um, do I regret that? No, I regret nothing, um, but here we are. So now my application on my phone that I need to log into my computer wants to update. So great, now we have to wait on that. That's okay. So all my to-do lists I currently have Finish my work report, work out, film this video, edit this video, and then I also have to film the other video, or like film like a part of it. All right, let's get to it. I think I'm going to make a delicious cup of tea. Or should I drink a Celsius? That's dangerous. I actually, I had a morning coffee, then I had an afternoon coffee. If I drink a Celsius now, I'm not sleeping, so. Um, I think my future me will not be happy if I do this to myself. So I'm not going to do that. Also, I don't know what it is about going into the office or on days I have to go to the office. I suck at drinking my water. And I, saw, I used to take this water bottle, but it just got to be so bothersome having to carry it. So I only bring like a smaller water bottle. Usually it's less than 32 ounces or it is my hydro flask, but if you watched one of my previous vlogs, I gave my hydro flask to my sister, so... And that was the one with the cool top, so... I haven't been taking my other hydro flask, and... No, stop playing with this piece of paper. Stop that. Honestly, I don't even want tea, or coffee, or caffeine. I don't want any of that, I just wanna finish my work. So, tonight's playlist of choice is Intent Piano and Violin, but... I'll link it below, or I'll let you know if it works or not.
so it's been an hour-ish, probably a little bit more if I'm being honest. And I'm just about done. I'm at the part where it's like not the hard part that I need to like really be focusing on. Um, so I feel good about that. Like I'm towards the end of the process, which is fantastic. I can't believe I really did, did I really did this. I can't believe I really like did it. It's 10.06. I feel all right. I, if I can get this out by 10.30, I feel like I should still have some energy to work out. So no one asked these questions, but I'm gonna answer them anyway. Why am I up so late? Why can't I let myself sleep? I don't know. I did not know. Will people care if I had turned this in? Will it make a difference if I turn this report in at 7 a.m. versus 10.30 p.m.? I don't know. I don't know. I feel like if I was someone's manager, I really would rather my employee be alert and energized for the workday. But I, I just personally feel like since I made this commitment to myself to do this report at a certain time, it's really hard for me to like change course. And I'm just really stubborn about that and I refuse to accept that otherwise. And it's partially the reason that yes, I hold myself back for my, like my own life, but it's partially another reason that I've been able to achieve a lot. Hopefully, I think, I don't know. But in reality, it's I have no chill. And that is, I just have never had any chill. And it's really tough, tough for me. I blame being a Virgo rising, but I know the real person to blame is just myself nothing to do with when i was born nothing to do with my enneagram none of that it's just literally i make sometimes the conscious decision to do this sometimes unconsciously my anxiety gets the best of me and my fear of failure in for like the future gets the best of me and here we are regardless it makes me feel happy when i can achieve even a, just a task for some reason i tie so much of myself to that just achieving tasks and you know lately whatever makes me happy i just try to do more of that whether that be working out even if it actually doesn't make me entirely happy in the moment that i'm working out but the after effect makes me incredibly happy and those endorphins are just irreplaceable now with work stuff it's just whatever allows me to feel like i'm ha like giving like contributing to the team in whatever form that may be in my personal opinion um like i'm going to do that because that makes me happy it makes me happy to have some small impact rather that be more clarity on something organization consistency being a reliable like teammate or employee I just like find joy in being able to do that consistently and constantly and I think that's what really keeps me going and I mean at the end of the day I chose this and I'm not completely sad about that I've watched so many people on YouTube in particular post about like their post-grad jobs but I never actually see them like in these kinds of times where like they actually have to work late. I think it's such a like enigma almost like post-grad work life balance. Like there is to some degree a few people that are transparent about the difficulties and the frustrations, but you don't actually like get to see that. And I think those are the parts that are like cool to see and I hope like y'all seeing me rather I know it's like not the most completely healthy thing it's just real like there are just some there are just some days that you just have to take work home and finish it
I did that quick workout. I jumped in the shower really quickly just to clean myself up and I was going to edit for a couple of hours or study for my exam either way but I just could not stare at a screen any longer so instead I think I'm just going to go to bed I was going to try to read my Kindle but again it's like screens and I feel like I've been looking at a screen all day and then I came home and looked at another screen for like a couple of hours and I think it's just too much screen time it's just not good for me so I think I'm going to get up early tomorrow hopefully go on like a walk outside because I feel like I haven't been outside in a while and I think that's just what like my mind needs it's what my body needs hopefully my cats can chill out for the night because they go wild at night and Hopefully I get a good night's rest, but yeah, this is my evening. It's not the most ideal evening if I'm being honest. Ideally, I would actually get time to rest. I would actually have like an evening to myself and all that jazz. I'm so excited to drink coffee in the morning. I'm also excited to sleep. So that'll be all for today. Hopefully you took away a piece of information from this video and you're able to find solace in that it's not always easy it's not always cute it's not always aesthetic it's kind of lame most of the time um i never really look cute doing like the hard stuff really and if you do good for you like actually great for you teach me your ways but yeah time for bed bye y'all thanks for watching